Welcome to Mount Ula. Standing at 1,840 plus meters above sea level, this mountain, situated in Itogon Benguet, is one of the best day hikes here in the Cordilleras. Mount Ula is known for its scenic views of the Cordillera mountain range, its verdant grassland, and its pine tree ridges. This destination has three main landmarks. First is the Ambanao Pawai Peak with its 360-degree view, followed by the iconic Gungal Rock, a massive rock formation that is kind of reminiscent of the Lion King's Pride Rock, and finally, the summit of Mount Ulap. For this trip, I am guiding eight people including two kids and a dog. Exciting! I am guiding under trail adventures. Hello everyone! For those who do not know, I am a mountain guide. And I've been guiding people to the different peaks of the Philippines from Luzon, Visayas, and Mindanao. I also lead international expeditions like Mount Kilimanjaro in Africa, Mount Tubkal in Morocco, and Mount Kinabalu to name a few. I've been guiding since 2009. For this year, I will be leading hikes in Nepal as we do the Annapurna Base Camp this coming October, followed by the Everest Base Camp on November. I am with Trail Adventures. To find out our schedule of hikes, please do visit us at www.trailadventures.com. And if you want to know the hikes that I will be personally leading, please do message me at kobisariel at gmail.com. Tara, akyat! It's the free year, Masha. You can go sideways. That will give you more traction. Right? Waiting for Kubo time. Rolling set. All good. Up and up, up and up. After that quick and steep ascent on a cemented road, the ascent continues but this time covered by the iconic pine trees of Benguet. After this continuous ascent of almost 2 kilometers, the trail will be easier as the slopes will be more gentle. Remember your trail food? Some of my go-to trail foods are dried fruits, chocolates, and nuts. Two kilometers. Two kilometer from the start of the trail, the cemented road. From there to the Barangay Point, 33 kilometers. I'm for mano. Mount Ulap is a wonderful destination for kids and pets. It offers a playful balance of challenge and fun in the middle of the majestic Cordillera Range. Just remember to keep an eye on them. Pero pag may time, okay na okay. Lovely weather. We are covered by pine trees. So it's not that hot. We've been hiking for an hour, 30 minutes now. Hard than I please. Kind of tiring, but not too much. We have a lot of rest to enjoy the mountain, to enjoy the view. And now, oh, I really miss Mount Ulap. Nice to be back. Now guiding the man. Now. An hour 
52 minutes, 4.15 kilometers. Peak, first peak, Ambanao, Pawai. Ambanao means Malawak po and Pawai means grassland. Yan. The, the, the face of that rock earlier. Yeah. <laughs> Where did you... <laughs> So there's a campsite here, campsite one. Dito na kasapang mga tao. However, while it's a perfect area, ganda eh. Be ready, especially for your water, kasi mo kawala mga water source dito. You need to carry everything from down, and it's okay. 4.24 kilometers. It will still be a great camping experience. Ah, maganda dito talaga, matulap, especially at night. Ano, clear weather. Ah, perfecto. Okay, here comes the kids. See ya. Yes. So we're at the first beat now. <laughs> Next destination, Gungal Rock. You're doing great, huh? <laughs> yes. But they, they like sweat. You can try it, but you can't because it's cheap. Oh, conception? Sure, I'll throw you. So from peak one to the Gonga Rock, you descend. Then you go up again, just like that. And kabutin ka ng araw. That was happening to us now. It's now around 11:04 na pala. We started really late, 9:30. Look behind me. Peak one. Let's descend that. Ascend again. To this part beautiful hill then you descend to the Gunga rock and then ascend again to the summit the beauty of hiking amazing big poop on my left if ever you see the body, a body of water, that's at the ocean, the sea, it's a dam, the San Roque Dam. Yep. So it is now 11.50. We've been hiking for 3 hours, 15 minutes now, and we are now at the Gungal Rock. One of the, one, if not the highlight, actually, for Mount Ulab. Best viewpoint from here, the Baba. And then we wait for them. We have a rock was left for me to take photos, you know, guide work. Gungal Rock is the most iconic part of Mount Ulap. Thus, 
this is where people take turns in taking photos. There were times when one would need to wait for almost two hours just to be able to have that shot. While the management has implemented a better approach to limit the number of people hiking at the same given time, I would still suggest, if possible, that you hike on a weekday to avoid the crowd. After taking photos, it was time to reapply sunscreen and to continue that traverse. Mount Ulab Sun, 1,846 meters above sea level. We're very close actually, but the, the challenge would be we're close, but the ascent is steep. And then from there, once we do the traverse going down, it's short and steep, but sweet. If you feel tired and exhausted, you may opt to bypass the summit, which some of us did. Next up, the Mountaineer stop for lunch. This stop offers food and drinks. Nice. Souvenir. They have Gatorade. Mountain Dew. Hot to go. So from the Mountaineer shop or Tambayan, we are doing that reverse. We've been in the mountain for 5 hours and 20 minutes now. 9.47 kilometers and this one it's roughly around one kilometer in the lanto. Papa ba. So let's do this. Mount Ula. Remember to conserve energy and to pace yourself. The descent may be really challenging. Finally banayad. <laughs> Second bridge. You know, 100 meters more. And the final bridge. And that's Mount Ula. Alright. Last bridge. <laughs> Maaluk. Good job. Good job. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Good job. Good job, good job. Good job. Good job. You wanna walk to get yeah. started? Good job. Yeah. Easy. Easy. Sure. <laughs> so we had three to Manila. We'll be taking the Victory Liner bus station. But before that, kaya mo tayo. Ang pangalan to ay Bang Bang. Beef, vegetables, sibuyas. Kanin, siyempre, sa baw. Sakto na to. Thank you for watching this Kobe Serial Tara Akyat.